What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you Linux Mint 9 release candidate. So I was installed a Linux Mint 9 on my desktop. Um, in, uh, let me see, one terabyte. And uh, I, um, I gotta say I absolutely love this distro. Um, it's like you already know, it's Debian based. Um, really cool distro and um, if you are a Windows user I will would recommend this distro because uh, well it looks a little bit like um, Windows if you gotta say <laughs> um, so let's see in graphics we got GIMP um, GIMP, which they removed in uh, Ubuntu 10.04, we still got it here in Linux Mint. Open Office, a Drawing Program, Scanner, and Simple Scanning. We got Firefox, uh, Giver, Gwiber, Mozilla Thunderbird, Pigeon, Bit Transmission, and XChat. We got some a few open office programs, uh, database presentation, uh, text treatment, wordbook, and sound and video. We've got Brassero, uh, movie player, GNOME M player, sound recorder, and we got sound control for pulse audio. Now, and rhythm box and pulse audio device chooser. Now this uh, DVD record my desktop and uh, open shot. I'm installed by myself uh, using this program called Program Manage Management. Okay, in System Tools we got System Profiles and Benchmark. I'll show you that later. In accessories we got like in Ubuntu the terminal of course get it we got file uploader uh, CD and DVD burner administration we've got app apt on CD hardware drivers uh, system Upload manager, window, Windows w wireless drivers, settings, we've got desktop settings. And we, we've got compass config by default. And a really cool thing, I don't know, I didn't know if, if uh, this is in uh, the 8, Linux Mint 8 version, but we've got simple compass config settings manager. I'll just show you that. Um, it's just like the normal one, just like the name says, more simple. So you can install this in uh, Ubuntu Software Center as well. Got appearance, screens, windows. So one thing I would like to show you guys is this program management like I said before it's basically like a Ubuntu software center let it load and here we've got uh, featured accessories, entertainment, games, graphics, internet, office, science and so on so if I search on um, DVD, which I use in uh, Ubuntu, you got it. We've got record my desktop and uh, open shot, just like I need. Let's see Kaden live. If we got that. Oh, sorry. We've got Kaden live, and Kaden live data read a little bit about the application uh, really cool uh, this is just like software center in Ubuntu K 
Kdenlive data and Kdenlive dbg. What else? Uh, let's go to games. No, you know what? Let's try to search, search first. Person shooter. First person shooter. No games. Let's see open shot. Oh, open, uh, open. What's it called? Alien arena. No. Didn't get that in uh, the program management. But we've got Nexus, which I just made a video about. The Nexus uh, game, a fast paced 3D first person shooter. Uh, we got, yeah, we got Open Arena. So I guess. We got Alien Arena 2. Yeah, right there. Alien Arena. So it's just like uh, Ubuntu Software Center. The same applications, I think. We've got the home folder right here with the nice minty look. And I gotta say, this is very fast. Uh, even though I'm recording, it's working pretty fast. Let's see some backgrounds. And I'm using my HE, HEI, sorry, HEI graphics card. And Compass is working like a charm. From Freedom came Elegance. As you can see, Linux Mint 9. Release Candidate. This offers some really cool uh, wallpapers. Now let's try this one. So uh, if you haven't tr uh, tried Linux Mint, I would highly recommend you to try it. It's amazing. Now let's see, we've got the terminal of course, and uh, control center, package management, so let's go to control center, select the menu, basically, let's see, um, yeah it's like the menu, sound, You've got sounds. I'm using my Logitech microphone. We can also do this in, uh, let me show you, sound control for pulse audio. You can also do it right here. As you can see, I'm talking. La 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 la. As you can see. System sounds set to 92%. Out data, so on. Configuration. So, this is a Linux Mint 9 release candidate. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.